Hi, a very good evening to all of you. So today with us, we have Rahul Mittal, who has got into Delhi School of Economics for pursuing Masters in Economics in the academic session 24-25. Welcome, Rahul. Oh, thank you, sir. Okay, Rahul. Uh, let's begin with a very basic question in terms of uh, in terms of your background in bachelor's. Uh, if you could just guide us through that first. Um, sir, I have completed my graduation in BA Economic Honors from Ramjas College, Delhi University. Okay, okay, great. Okay, Rahul, since uh, since I, I remember usually all the conversation that I have with all of you, okay? so I remember that uh, from day one, DSC was the institution that you were targeting, okay? Yeah. Not, not even the IITs, not even the ISI, DSC was the first rank institution. So when exactly was in your bachelor's that you decided ki from Ramjas, I'll be moving on to do school to pursue my master's in economics? Um, sir, at the time of when I was in second year, uh, in third semester, I planned to do my master's and I want to pursue my master's from D school as it is a brand name. Uh, it is a very old institute. So I want to pursue from, uh, I want to pursue my master's from that institute. And sir, uh, and sir, that's only sir. Take care. That's fine. Okay. So, uh, how, how's the feeling right now at, at home among your among your friends as well? So, how's the feeling once you uh, achieved this feat? Once you once it was finalized that you have finally got into D school. So, what was the feeling like at home? Yeah. Um, sir, feeling was great. Uh, my mo mother father was very happy about when they listened that I have come, I have get into DSC, and my friend were also very happy after listening to this news. Uh, they congratulated me, and uh, I was very thankful to uh, Artha Point Arzu ma'am and Sir you for always guiding me and giving your guidance. Great, great. Uh, let me tell all of you that Rahul is very very honest and very sweet in terms of whenever he ask anything or answers anything he's, he's very honest and sweet uh, just like the answer that he shared he, the joy was there visible among his family members and of course among his uh, his friend circle as well great Rahul great Achha, Rahul uh, tell me ki, uh, is there anything that you have planned post your masters ki, uh, one thing is ki ghar wale bolte hai ki go into the government sector okay you usually have someone from Gen Z, they have want to go into the corporate sector as well. Take care. Some of them will want to deep dive into the subject of economics and go for research work and PhD work. So what's your uh, go-to thing post-masters? Um, sir, my goal was to go in corporate sector and to grab a good placement. Um, it, was, it was my dream to have my dream job in Google or uh, in Facebook, like uh, these companies, like big four companies. And mm -hmm. sir, like, uh, uh, I was very keen, uh, like uh, to uh, be in the institution like DSC so that I can easily get my placements. And I also wanted my uh, open the gate for government job also. I, I have uh, some dream, like I have to pursue IS. So nice. I want to be, I want to take optional eco economics, uh, at there. Great. Great. Okay. So you have, you have, uh, you want to have the experience of both the domains. Ki ap, thoda time ke at least you will work in the corporate sector to begin with, you know, to, to understand, to understand the mechanism at the same time, you also have a goal into the civil service as well. So great, great round. Achha. So, uh, like you come from eco background, right? And the structure that we have designed is come from basic, intermediate and advanced, right? So, uh, what was your approach? Were you going live? Matlab, were you going with advanced level intermediate or did you even touch the basic level? Because that was very basic in nature for especially non-eco background. Yes, sir. As I coming from eco background, I have uh, restrained from basic lectures because First of all, I I joined late uh, the coaching, so there was a lot of backlog uh, remains. So first of all, I started to uh, do the intermediate level lectures, and sir, then I moved to advanced lectures. And sir, my uh, first goal was to complete my backlogs. 
because as back as backlog uh, as backlog will pile up so they will create a pressure uh, so sir i have completed my backlogs and as soon as possible i started my advanced lectures uh, and sir uh, then i was, then when i need to do the basics i sometimes reach out to the basic videos but my main focus was on intermediate and uh, advanced lectures only good good so you have summed it very well like what i told all the students as well ki aap eco background se ho so there is no need to spend much time or even a single second on basic level because you are conceptually at least from that level you are strong enough so good yeah. okay okay so uh, rahul in terms of strategy if you would like to share anything uh, for the coming students okay who are targeting all these entrances something that you feel ki ha this is this will help them or this made a, a difference in your preparation um uh, yes sir uh, being talk about strategy i want to tell that uh, first of all the uh, the aspirant first of all try to complete his backlog as he want as he should try to join the coaching at right time he should know the right time to join the coaching and after that if he if he has some backlog so he should all, uh, work on how to complete his backlog at time and after that uh, as soon as possible he complete his syllabus so that he gets a maximum time for revision because sir revision is the primary uh, or the x factor which remains uh, which was my which was in my uh, uh, study time as i have uh, revised two to three times my whole course so this made a very good impact uh, on my uh, studies and in exams also so i will uh, uh, i will uh, suggest the aspirants that they will complete their uh, course as soon as possible and starting their revision and after that they should do time series uh, test series uh, as soon as possible uh, they should not restrain themselves to to not to do test series they should also do the complete their weekly assignment as they are posted uh, and uh, always listen to their teachers like arju ma'am they were very helpful great great thank you thank you so much rahul i guess you have uh, literally summed it summed it up from uh, like from the very first step in case agar aap late join karte ho then it's fine make sure you complete your backlog asap and then be aligned with the regular classes and once you complete your syllabus you have to make sure that revision is equally important along with completing the syllabus and yes. when when you what you call it as icing on the cake is your past years and mock test papers jo aap log jab shiddat se karte ho then it adds value to your preparation yes sir great great rahul